Okay, so do you want to see me cry? Okay, let's play the clip. So now that you saw me crying like a baby, let me go ahead and tell you that the love that God has for us is so, so big, so immense, that when you feel an encounter with Him, all you can do is cry and feel happy and just thank Him. And that's what I was doing. I was praying in the Spirit and just thanking Him for everything He's done for me, thanking Him for all the knowledge and wisdom He has instilled in me. And I keep learning, I keep growing each day. So I just thank Him for keeping my faith strong in Him and believing that no matter what, when He is with me, nothing can come against me um, or nothing can defeat me. Um, and I also wanted to share with you guys a little bit of the praise and worship that happened in the morning. So here's that clip. And I just love to dance and sing and worship God. It's so awesome. My kids love to do it as well. Every now and then I catch them uh, singing praise and worship songs and we just, every time we're in a car, we're playing worship songs as well. We're just singing our hearts out to God and we just love Him so much. Um, and yeah, I wanted to go ahead and share that with you. If you are not in a good relationship with God right now, I suggest starting out by just praying. You don't have to have a perfect prayer. Um, I'm still learning and learning how to um excuse me how to pray you can open up your bible and just ask god to let you read what he wants you to learn today um you, ha you can ask him for wisdom you can let the holy spirit fill you um what else i'm trying to think of the right words to say because i don't want to say the wrong things and that's one of the reasons why it took a long time to upload i think it's been about a month because I want to share with you guys my walk with God, but I don't want to say the wrong things or interpret the Bible wrong. And so that's what I was afraid of. But today's service was about not being afraid, not being intimidated by others. Just let God fill you with the Holy Spirit and show you what is in store for you. Is that what I want to say? I don't know. God will fill me with the words that he wants me to tell you guys. And that's what I'm trying to do. And I'm learning. I'm trying. I'm new at this. But I do want to share my story with you guys. My walk with God. So right now, I am on my way to my ex's house. I'm actually a few blocks away. I'm just sitting here in the car vlogging this video for you guys. Because I wanted to share my experience this morning. Um, he has my bike. He has had my bike for about a year, year and a half. And he's finally deciding to give it back to me. So I'm going to go pick it up. I've been wanting to take the kids bike riding to the beach. So this would be the perfect time where I can get all the bikes set up and take them. So I'm going to pick up the bike, take it to my mom's house. And then I'm going to see what I do from there. I have a couple of things that I have to do. But I'm not sure yet what order I'm going to do them first. So yeah, just stay tuned and I'll take you guys along with me. Okay, so I got my bike here in the back. All the seats are folded down. And I put the car seats right here next to me for the meantime. Right now, I'm at a taco place right here. I am going to order some food because I am starving. It is 1.42 p.m. and I still have not ate. I'm going to head to my mom's house, drop off the bike, ride it around for a little bit just to test to see if the brakes are working, if the tires need air. And if they don't, then I'll go ahead and just put it away. I'm taking some boxes down because he gave me a couple boxes of hand sanitizer. They look like this. So that's what I'm going to take down first. And then I'm taking down the bike. Okay, this is the next box. Which I have to take down before I take down the bike. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Oh, the seatbelt's stuck here. Oh, sorry guys, sorry, sorry, sorry. Got it. 
happy and the tires are flat so i'm gonna go ahead and have to fix that first there's the bike like a mint green color it's supposed to have a basket in the front but i have it i like how flat the tire is okay so now i just put this thing in and now i'm going to put some air in here let's see if it goes up. Okay, the bush is holding you guys. Please don't fall. The camera was very, very expensive. Okay, let me roll this bike back a little bit. Oh, I hope. Okay. Okay. So now that I have you guys on this angle, the bush is holding you guys. Take off the top. Why is it not coming off? Oh, I was turning it the wrong way. Okay. Ooh, don't fall off. Okay. It's ready. Look how much it's missing. Watch I pop the tire. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's good enough. I'm just gonna wipe it down a bit and test it because I won't check the brakes. And yeah. So I'll probably put you guys on this here. Okay, that should be fine. I'm just gonna ride around over there. You guys will see me in a bit. Alright, here I go. I haven't ridden a bike in a while. Let's see. Hopefully I don't fall. Put some WD-40 on this, and then try to get it to the first. Um, what's it called? To the first gear because it's really, really hard right now. I'm gonna have to mess with it and see how to get it back to the first gear. But other than that, it works. Everything works. <laughs> and yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and ride it around for a little bit. Feels good. Okay, so I just got home and the kids just got home and Hello. they're literally so Hello. dirty. Look how dirty their face is. And look at my cheek. Yes, were you guys playing in the dirt at your dad's house? No? Okay. Well, I'm going to give you guys a little mini haul because I got some stuff for the kids and stuff for the house. And yeah, that's what I went to go do after the bike stuff. She so, brought that yummy hey, food. <laughs> you want to show them this? I want to show it to them. This is a little bathtub. How cute is this? Comes with a little rubber ducky, a soap bar, and this little um, shower. shower thing. Yeah. Yeah. So we got, well, actually, I got this for baby girl Ariel. And we're and gonna go ahead and open it. Yep. You can shower your little dollies in here. What the? <laughs> it says doll, doll bath places. Mm hmm. And this is what it is. Congratulations. Okay. Wow. Bye-bye. Next gift for the next person. Bye. Okay. And it's me. Next one is a football for you. And a football for you because I know you guys rip yours in the morning. Remember? You ripped? I did? Yeah, the little green one. I can see that. I got some sponges for um to wash the dishes. I normally don't buy these, but I just got them just in case. Uh, bar soap, which are uh, the lavender scent. Oh, it's not even focusing. There you go. These smell so good, and they're only a dollar for two bars. So I got these two. And then we have I got a surprise for Eli. That's bath bomb number one. What? Uh, a Paw Patrol Where's bath bomb. Where's the other one? Yay! Hold on, I got one for you too, Mama. What? Oh, here they are. What? Bath yeah. bomb number two, Mickey Mouse. <laughs> Go right and let's see. Yeah, when you shower right now, you guys yeah, gonna take a bath. Right 
And then I have for my mamacita, best mom number three. It's mama pink. Yeah, and I bought a couple packets of little mini pads because y'all know what time it is. Okay. I bought these socks as well. They look really soft, so I got yeah, one. Yeah, mommy. Yeah, as soon as we go in the shower, then I can open it for you guys. Do you want to show them? Yo, it's my Mickey Mouse. Yeah, it's a it's a Minnie Mouse. Okay, so I bought a little scrunchie for Ariel. Look, another little Oh, these are mine. This was a surprise. Like these are the little gummy lifesavers. <laughs> Got some soap bottles for the restroom. Okay, let them go. Okay, we got four of those. Ariel. We got a bunch of toothpaste. I got these oh, for the Arrow. power right here. for the power outlets just so the kids won't be tempted to put anything in there. Um, Ziploc bags. And just some warm gloves that they're mom, um mom, mom. they're like these fuzzy material. Detangling spray for Ariel's hair because it just happens to get tangled so quickly. And eucalyptus um, oil, oil essential oils for whenever we're sick and we want to put the oil diffuser, we will go ahead and use this. So, I know you guys can hardly see me, but thank you so much for watching my video. I will, guys, ah, blah, blah, blah. thank you guys so much for watching my video. If you enjoyed watching me just run errands, go ahead and click that like button, and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye. Bye. <laughs> bye. Bye. Bye.